Crocodilians, like turtles and tortoises, have barely changed since the time of the dinosaurs. Today, crocodiles, caiman and alligators live in tropical waters throughout the world. Crocodiles and tortoises are obviously very different. But they do have one thing in common, armour. Their bodies are encased by tough, thick scales, particularly along the back. In tortoises, that armour is clearly defensive. But for crocodiles, it has an extra function. Just below each of these scales lies a network of blood vessels. A crocodile can control the flow of the blood within them. When basking, it allows it to circulate freely, so transferring the sun's warmth from these ridged scales to the rest of its body. The crocodile, in short, has rows of very effective solar panels all down its back. And a sophisticated solar heating system like that is a very valuable facility for a cold-blooded creature. Being cold-blooded brings considerable advantages to a crocodile. Whereas a warm-blooded predator, like a lion, would die if it didn't feed every few days, a crocodile, if necessary, can go without food for months on end. 